Hey, White Sand Man, coming back at you with another video. Um, in this one, I'll be showing y'all how to use the six-axis controller with your computer, with your PC. Um, I'll be using Windows XP, a 32-bit version. Uh, what you'll need is your six-axis controller and this one side USB Type A, the other side Mini USB. Um, basically, what that is is the one that plugs into your controller. This plugs into the computer. Um, from what I understand right now, it doesn't work wirelessly. Um, so you will need the USB card. All right. So let's get into it. I'll show you on the computer. All right. So what you're gonna do? First off, you're gonna have to get to this website. Um, I'll have the link posted in the in the detail section of this video. So I'll give you the link to this. You'll get to this website. What you're gonna then gonna do is download the six axis driver. It's right underneath here under this advertisement. It says download. You click download. And what happened? I don't know. So I'm gonna go ahead and click download again. There you go. <laughs> so it says open or save. I'm just gonna open it. Fuck it. Just click open. As you can see, it opens there. What I'm then going to do is copy them to my desktop. And since I already have those there, I'm just going to click fucking no and no. Alright. Close that. Close that. Minimize this. Minimize that. Minimize all my windows. I don't need them. Alright, so there you have these three that I just got to my desktop right here. Um... What you're then going to do is you're then going to double click on this. That'll happen. Once that happens, all it does is flash the CMD real quick. Once that happens, you take your six axis controller, hook up the hook it up to your computer, the USB, plug it in, plug it in. All right, once it plugs in, um, I don't know, you can go ahead and press the PS button if you like, you know, if you're comfortable. <laughs> Alright, so once it's plugged in, what you're then going to do is you're then going to, um, go ahead and open your control panel. Put on game controllers. And as you can see, oops, it should show up there. But as of now, it won't work. So, there's nothing you can do about that, so... Minimize that. Then you're going to run this. I already have it installed, so it's going to pop up like that. Um, but for you, you're going to install that. Once that's done, what you're then going to do is you're then going to open up your computer. Let me just scale this to size. Um, local disk. Go to Windows and System 32. Open up System 32. And then see that file right there, ps 36 axis underscore en. You're going to drag that and drop it inside system 32. As you can see here, I already did it. Um, so yeah, you're going to drag it from your desktop, pop it into system 32. Once it's in there, close this up. Go to start, run. And then this run box will pop up. Type in cmd for command, command prompt. This box will pop up, put in PS3, um, actually, you know, what's it called? I forgot what it's called. You retype this, so PS3, 6 axis, S, I, X, A, X, I, S, underscore, E, N, click up, click enter, and this will pop up. Uh, it says found two buses, gives you a little bit of information there, cool. Click enter once more, and then close this off. Uh, once that's done, reopen your control panel, go back to game controllers, this will pop up once again, um, double click on the PS3, and as you can see, let's plug this in, uh, you, pe you press the PS button once you're in here, then it'll turn on, and as you can see, if I move my right analog stick, the red things go up and down, I'm just doing circles right now, if you do the left analog stick, you know, I'm doing circles with that. Clicking the buttons will highlight the numbers. Um, so as you can see, it all works. Um, 
All right, just a quick recap. What you do is you then go to the site that's posted up in that corner somewhere. Um, so go to that site, download the driver, put the three files on your desktop. Um, once they're on your desktop, run the PS3 six axis underscore EN. Once that's ran, plug in your controller, uh, run the libusb file. Uh, once that's installed, uh, what you then do is you put your PS3 six axis underscore EN file in your system 32. Once it's in there, close that out. Go to file, run, cmd. Oh, that opens up the command prompt. Um, once in there, type in ps3 six axis underscore en. Um, the, the bunch of words will show up. You know, uh, click X on that once that's done. Then after that, go into your control panel. Uh, check out your gamepad section. The PS3 should be in there. So click on that. Double click on that. Press your PS button. PS and you'll be good. And you'll be good to do if you move your joysticks or press any of the buttons. It shows up on your computer. That means you're good to go. It'll work for all your games. And that is it. So that's it for this episode. Everybody, you know, comment my shit, subscribe. Um, check out all my homeboy shit. Check out DLB's blog. Check out the POB. Check out everything. Check everything out. So that is it. Peace. Peace.